Hi guys, uh, my name is Nick, Nick Asgill, and uh, I don't usually do this, but I, I feel compelled that I've got to make this video. See, I've been thinking, and I've been thinking, and I want to talk to you really briefly about excess luggage. Now, uh, when I say excess luggage, I'm talking about excess baggage. I'm talking about all the things that we have in our lives that weigh us down that, well, we could actually do without. Uh, it's 3.30 in the morning. Uh, I'm just about to catch a transit flight. Um, and what really brought this uh, conversation that I think we, we will be having based on this video is yesterday I missed a connecting flight. Uh, and you know I was really raring to go I was really excited and you know I got a bit angry I got a bit frustrated as you would you know um, but the airline um, put us in a hotel I'm, I'm in the hotel I, I'll show you through in a minute um, but whilst I was here uh, I started checking my bags and I realized that uh, I actually had excess baggage you know and the excess baggage that I had was not really due to stuff in the bags for me, but stuff for other people. Um, and for the first time in my life, I have excess baggage. Usually when I pack for me, I know how I gauge myself and I you know, monitor my limitations and you know, my expectations as to what I can and can't do. And uh, whilst I was repacking the suitcases, it, it hit me like, how many of us actually go through life in general on a day-to-day -day basis with excess baggage? Now, when I say excess baggage, I'm not by any means suggesting that we be very selfish and we cut everyone off. But how many of us go through the motions and have emotions and challenges that really has nothing to do with our lives? That literally just bear upon us that other people transfer the transference of energies. I'm talking about energies that people pass on to us that we really could do without. That slowing you down, that slowing me down, that slowing all of us from achieving our dreams. Now, I'm not by any chance saying don't care. I'm not by any chance saying don't assist anyone. But I would like to submit to you that if you we, us, were to live our lives being very mindful of excess baggage, I think it would really help in terms of where we're going. Because sometimes I get a phone call in the morning and, you know, it'd be someone wanting to offload something onto me, something that doesn't really have any direct instant bearing to my life. It's not an emergency. Uh, it's nothing that I can do. It's just they don't want to deal with it and sometimes some people find it better if they just really complain about the situation you know especially the people who don't want to hear a solution all they want to do is talk about it and they'll talk about the same problem on monday on tuesday or wednesday and you just have to listen and subconsciously as the listener you are a, a participant and you're you're taking in this stuff and it's weighing down your psyche you know I'm just trying to say that I know a lot of people are going to tell me, oh, the human has a potential to do this and, and that unlimited. Yes, I know that. But in everything, it's in measurable, quantifiable steps. Every day has 24 hours. Regardless what, you cannot make it 25 hours. Every week has seven days. You know, every human has a certain limit that they can have at any one point in time. Every year has 12 months. After that, there's a cycle, there's a regeneration, there's a refreshing. But I'm just submitting to you that today, if you were to make a conscious decision to not be bogged down by excess baggage, either the things that you put on yourself or the things that other people put on you, that your life would be a lot better. It will be a lot smoother and things would become a lot clearer. Um, hit me up. Let me know what you think. Subscribe. Hit me on Twitter, Instagram, whatever the case. Let me know what you think. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm just being selfish. But I just believe that excess baggage is something that weighs each and every person down. Now, I come from a great family, but I started with very humble beginnings. 
and I've had to work really hard for every single thing to get to this stage. So when I get a phone call or I have a conversation, or I meet up with an old friend and, you know, they're trying to offload that excess baggage onto me. I'm really not that dude because I just believe that I have to keep it moving. I cannot stay still. So hit me up. Let me know what you think. Excess baggage is not good for your life. This is my excess baggage that I'm working with. I'm now having to pay extra just in order to accommodate this extra baggage for other people. But I'm not complaining. It's life. You got to help out. But yeah, please, if you agree, press like, share, comment. I look forward to hearing from you guys, okay? Have a blessed and fulfilled day. Peace.